Hello, it's Felonius the Old Yapper, and I'm going to take one of Ron's suggestions. Fate or destiny? Well, it looks good on paper to have a fate or a destiny. And when I was a bit younger, I actually thought that yes, there is a plan to all this. There is some, some sort of thought about this. Yes, there are some greater scheme. There are some greater power who are controlling everything and making sure that I am going the right way and I have some sort of meaning in life. <laughs> yeah, stupid. There is absolutely nothing that controls you. Now, a fate? Well, sort of. Because if, if you are... Well, I'm, I'm using those two words, by the way, as the same thing. If there is some sort of fate because your, your actions gets a reaction. And those things, the, the decisions you make, will, of course, control what you are going to encounter later in life, of course. If you are not taking your driving license when you are 18 in Sweden, you are most likely not going to have any driving license at all until you are too old and you will not get that work um, that you should have had. Mostly because, mm, yeah, we need our driving license in Sweden. And I think it's the same in US. However, in India, I doubt that you need a driving license. There is enough traffic as it is, and you can always ride uh, outside a bus. Yeah, not inside, because you never get inside. Um, however, being born somewhere also is some sort of fate, destiny. Um, if you are born in the Western civilization, you do have some sort of leniency towards a certain type of life. Um, and But that's not really something that is, is decided for you or something that anyone else controls. That is just the social thing of being born here. And if you're born somewhere else, like in, well, I don't know, um, Africa perhaps where you don't have food enough for yourself you don't perhaps you don't have a lo that long a life but I really doubt that we have some sort of fate or destiny um, it would be good of course uh, if we know that everything is going to work out fine but I doubt that um, and it wasn't not until I get to the other side of 50 that I realized that no, I'm just that bug. And sometimes you're the bug and sometimes you're just the windshield. And that's all there is to it. There, there is no other stuff. Um, I could most likely be dead when I was one year old and that would have not changed anything in the world today. And when hum humanity is gone from this planet the, the planet will go back to what it should be, living its own life, like it should. So there is no sort of greater cause or anything. That is something that we invent in order to make sure that we are not committing suicide on the first steep thing we, we get. But we are having fun while we are living, and that's more important than any fate or destiny. Uh, however, and this is m m m uh, also a thing, if you are clever, if you are intelligent, or if you are creative enough, you do have a place on this planet. Well, you, Ron, however, you have uh, the means to influence people, make people comfortable and make people think and create more. And that's maybe your destiny. Perhaps that is the thing that you are thinking of. But in my personal case, no, I have none. I hoped and I thought, but um, no. Um, I could die tomorrow and no one's the wiser. That is on a big scale. 
in you can't have a fate or a destiny in a small scale just for the family that's not really going to happen thanks for listening bye